Anna and Tom have gone all up market and are hosting a fancy garden party. Ooh. While the Brun dog's skipping it and hanging back at the agency. Yeah, not really a scene, to be fair. This is going to be a real eye-opener, a first look at what we're dealing with. But at the end of the night, we're going to be making them ask somebody out on a date. And with the front lawn already round full of love-hungry singles harvested from Instagram, it's time to throw our first celeb to the wolves. Who's it going to be? It's going to be Sir Nita. <laughs> Love the oh. oh, I see. <laughs> what do you think? I mean, it looks lovely, doesn't it? Mm -hmm, Just mm -hmm. ripe to be penetrated now. What? Don't frighten her, Tom. Would you like me to convey you? That's it. Give her a hand. Right, who's first on the menu for our 80s pop icon? This guy over here? Maybe him? I will do. Oh, Mr Kipling. Hi. Hello, Sunita. How are you? I'm very well, thank you, sir. What's your name? Andy. Andy. Pleased to meet you. You all right? Nice to meet you too, yes. Take a seat. Thank you. You look amazing. Thank you Absolutely so much. amazing. So you know what I did? That's funny. What did you do? I jumped on a plane this morning at half past four from Marbella. Are you serious? To come and see you. Calm down, EasyJet. We've all been to Spain. Is that where you live? I do. You live in Marbella and you yeah. came... I did. Oh, my gosh. I did. And okay. I'm still so excited. I'm very, very, very grateful for that. Thank so you, thank Andy. you for coming to see me. Yay. How nice. All right, Andy. Sunita is the celeb, you know. Oh, and look who's snuck in through the back door. Prowling around looking for a genital. It's the dating apprentice, Navid. Oh, God. Hi, you're all right. Hi, nice to meet you. You OK? Navid, thank, thank you so Hi, much. Really Pleasure. Nice to meet you. you OK? Thank you. Oh, oh sorry. Just go for a second. So tell me a bit about yourself. Have you been on any dates before? That you, or, yeah, yeah, I have been on a few dates. I'm on all the dating apps. I love it. I'm giving it my best shot, basically, yeah. um, but not very lucky in love. Still waiting for the right one for me. So yeah, have you been in many relationships before? I've not been in a relationship before. Same here, I've same never here. dated any. Well, well, to be honest, I've not been in an actual date. Yeah. And yeah, and I'm still a 28 proud virgin. 28 year old proud virgin. Yeah. You cheers to that. Cheers to that. that. <laughs> there is nothing wrong with that. Not at all. You get 10 percent off at Games Workshop. If you don't mind me asking, are you, like, a virgin as well? Um, I, I'm not. <gasps> She's had sex. Now, arriving for her first time at a mixer, it's Love Island's Laura. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, guys. You look delicious. Yes. Don't you? Guys, remember, your mission is have fun. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have fun. We need to put the fun back into your love life. Go! OK, I'm going to go this way. I'm my pants. Give me a drink. <laughs> Hold it together, Laura. Excuse me. Hi, you all right? Yeah, hi. Hi, what's your name? Laura. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, what's really your name? Fraser, sorry. She's fretful as a porcupine. She really doesn't feel confident. She is definitely a fart in a colander right now. <laughs> what does that even mean? Where are you from? Well, originally from London, but then okay. moved up to Manchester. I've okay. been to Italy for a few years. My old man's from around there, so he's uh, he's been there for a Oh, you're Italian? Years. Well, I, f I pretend I am. That's cool. <laughs> speak it and all that, but yeah. Do I had to get you? that in there, didn't I? <laughs> so you can feel born and speak Italian? Si, That's impressive. Si, italiano. Non tanto, ma puoi parlare un po'. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's bad, so bad. You must get so many girls with that. That's I don't, because I, I don't mention it. Uh, you literally just did, mate. He's fit, confident, and even speaks Italian. Yummy. A tutti con the frutti. And hungry to get her teeth into some man meat of her own is Jordi Galbethan, man. Oh, oh darling! It's Bethan! <laughs> hey! I'm not going to lie, I'm so excited for this mixer, but I'm shaking like a dog. Oh, nice. I want you to really take all by the horns, OK? Big girl pants on. Yeah. All right? Got me flutey niggas on, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. Do you like dogs? Love dogs. A friend of mine uh, was working voluntarily at this dog rescue place. Again, these puppies that clearly been abused and just not trep right. And this one little faffy dog, and I wasn't very much into dogs at the time, this was six years ago, I was sort of sat there, like, sort of, like, a bit upset. And I was like, well, what's wrong with him? Yeah. And the lady said, well, his sister's just been taken today to be adopted. So he's now on his own oh. and he's got... And I was like... Stop wow. it. <laughs> I was like, wrap it up and taking it. So far, so good. Yay! Have you been single, like, long? Oh, yeah. I've got high standards, I think, I'd, I'd say. But, again, I'm a bit of a stiff as well. I like a, I like a what nice does a stiff mean? A stiff's a bit like, do you know what I mean? Like the boring things in life. Do you know what a I mean? A stiff? I've never heard of that. Oh, yeah, likely story, Laura. 
So I wonder if I'm a stiff. I wouldn't say you are, no. You can find about the world. Stiff now. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Uh, I, I, I don't really know how to answer that, to be honest. Uh, I can resist. Yeah, I can. He's, you're um, hiding behind the table. <laughs> well, he's not denied it. I think you could be onto a winner here, Laura. Back over to Navid, and he's still chatting with experienced Emily. She's had sex at least once. So, what would you say is your usual type? What do you usually go for? So, obviously, like, right now, I'm, I'm, I'm like, open-minded. So I'm trying to see if I like more women or men. For, but if it's more like women, it would definitely be more like, you know, your kind of, like, personality and that kind of Nicki Minaj vibe and, like, do you know what I mean? That kind of, like, curve, that sass, you know, all of that. Are you a fan of Nicki? I am a fan of Nicki. Oh, I'm amazing. actually a big girl. Cheers to that. <laughs> It's so great that Emily's a fan of Nicki Minaj because I can talk about her for hours. Take care. Thank, <laughs> Thank you, Lily. Bye-bye. Well. Bye Just bye. not with her, apparently. Anyway, well done, Nav. You've popped your mixer cherry. Go on, boy. And opening her account now is Geordie Galbethan. What was that? I tried Geordie. It went Welsh. Hey, hi, right. hi. OK, nice how are you? I'm Adam. Nice to meet you. My name's Bethan. Nice to see you. Oh, oh, gentlemen, oh, gentlemen. gentlemen. That's me. <laughs> you know what? I feel good now that I've got Prosecco. <laughs> God, you've got lovely lashes, haven't you? Thank they're you. very long. Do you Jealous. know what? Yeah, no, people normally notice them. They're like, do you care? And I'm actually just lucky. Yeah. My dad's Moroccan and my mum's Spanish, so like, but I was born here. <gasps> oh my so God. I've got to get tanned well and things yeah. like that. Yeah, my dad's like Maltese. Maltese, oh, yeah. Okay. Well, he's half Maltese, so I'm like a quarter. Awesome. So I do tan quite well. Oh, my God, I'm already imagining our perfectly tanned babies. Hey, what's this? Sexy porno music? It can only mean one thing. Lock up your daughters, Wixie's here. Oh, oh I Mr. See. Lucy. Ah, uh, at ease, everyone. It's only Gaza, dad of four. Your body language is just screaming, bring it on. Really? Absolutely, yeah. Ah, You've you grown an inch. Have I? <laughs> yes. That happens. You sprout wings, my chum. Uh, all right, see you later. As Gary goes on the hunt... Like a rat up a drain pipe. Mr Marbella Andy is still charming the absolute f***s off Sunita. Full legal disclaimer, Sunita does not have... I coach kids' football. Oh. And have them for many years. Little tackers, the four year olds to 14. He saves dogs and coaches kids. Oh, just marry him now. While I was doing that and building that club up mm -hmm. for the kids, I got an opportunity to buy a football club. So I went and bought a football club in Gibraltar. He's like the Ryan Reynolds of Marbs. How buy can you buy a football club? So you see one for sale and go, Can I buy a football club, please? And the guy says, Give me a load of cash. And you're like, There you go. All right, Billy Big. Do you like football? I understand how it works. Okay, that's a start. Offside rule, go. I've been to a football match. Right, yeah. we need to go to a football I match. I saw grown men cry. Yeah, of course. Sing, Absolutely. cry, no, no, passion. No, no, no. I was yeah. like, Absolute Englishmen tears. don't do this. Oh, yeah, we do at football. Yeah. Well, yeah. you get it all out, right? Of course. <laughs> all that on the dance floor. Oh, he can dance as well. Oh, the da oh you're a dancer? I am. Oh, my gosh, I, I love it. I, I, I love it. Yay. I do. So I have to go and meet other people, unfortunately. You look amazing. Please don't talk to anyone else. Just sit here. You can put this in front Shall of your I? face if you want to. And um, I'm not here. I'll see you later. I'm not here. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done.